Hello everyone, welcome to our channel where we explore different topics related to history and culture. Today, we are going to talk about Saint Lucy Filippini, an Italian nun who dedicated her life to educating young girls and women in the 18th century. She is considered a pioneer in the field of education and her legacy is still celebrated today. So, let's dive in and learn more about this remarkable woman. Saint Lucy Filippini, also known as Saint Lucia, was a religious leader and founder of the Institute of the Religious Teachers Filippini. She was born in Cori, Italy in 1672 and was the eldest of 10 children. From a young age, she was known for her devotion to God and her desire to serve others. At the age of 20, Lucy joined the religious order of the Ursulines and began her training as a teacher. She quickly became known for her dedication and her ability to connect with her students. She was particularly skilled at working with young girls, and her teachings were focused on helping them to develop a strong faith and a sense of purpose in life. In 1711, Lucy was sent to the island of Malta, where she established the first school for girls in the region. Her work in Malta was incredibly successful, and she soon became known as a leader in the field of education. In 1715, Lucy returned to Italy and founded the Institute of the Religious Teachers Filippini. This organization was dedicated to providing education and spiritual guidance to young women, and it quickly became one of the most respected institutions of its kind in the country. Throughout her life, Lucy was known for her humility, her kindness, and her deep faith. She passed away in 1732 and was canonized by the Catholic Church in 1950. Today, her legacy lives on through the Institute of the Religious Teachers Filippini, which continues to provide education and spiritual guidance to young women around the world. Saint Lucy Filippini was a remarkable woman who dedicated her life to serving others. Her work in education and her devotion to God continue to inspire people today. She is an excellent example of how one person's actions can make a difference in the lives of many and how we can all make the world a better place through our actions. That concludes our video on Saint Lucy Filippini. We hope you found this information interesting and inspiring. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. We'll be covering different topics every week so you won't want to miss out. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.